All right, let's take a look at how easy it is to hand in your work using the Brightspace Pulse app. The first thing we need to do is find an activity where work has to be handed in to a Dropbox. If your work needs to be handed into a Dropbox, at the bottom of the activity page, you'll find a link to the Dropbox or the assignment folder that you need to submit your work to. To hand in your work to the Dropbox or the assignment folder, simply click on the Add File button. To use your phone to take pictures of your work and then submit that work into a Dropbox, click on the My Computer link and then click on the Upload button. You'll then be presented with a number of different ways that you can add a file to the Dropbox. You can use your phone's camera to take a picture of your work. You can record video, record your voice, or you can click on the Files icon and search your photo gallery for images of your work that you've already taken with your phone. Let's first take a look at how you can use your phone's camera to take a picture of your work to hand it into a Dropbox. Click on the camera icon, make sure your work is in focus, and take a picture. You'll be given an option to either retry the picture or accept it by clicking OK. You can take as many pictures as you like, allowing you to hand in all of your work at the same time. Simply click the Upload button to take more pictures of your work. Once you've captured all the images of your work, Click the Add button at the bottom of the page. If the picture you've taken is blurry or not in focus, click Retry and take the picture again. You can also upload pictures that you've already taken. All you need to do is click the Upload button and then select File down on the bottom right hand corner. Navigate to where the picture is stored, select the image you want to upload and it will automatically be added to the list to be uploaded to the Dropbox. Once you have all the files and images that you need, click the Add button at the bottom of the screen to upload your files to the Dropbox. On the screen you'll see a summary of all the files that are ready to be submitted. You'll also see a list of the files with links to those files. If you want to make sure that you're handing in the right work, you can click on each one of those links to see the images or the files that are about to be uploaded. If you've forgotten something, all you need to do is click on the Add a File button and you can add more files to the list. You can also add an audio recording or a video recording with your phone. When you're ready to hand in your work to the Dropbox, scroll down, you can add a comment if you like, and then click the Submit button. If everything works the way it should, you'll get a confirmation page showing the files that you've handed in and any comments you added. All students need to do now is click the Done button and they can start working on their next activity. So far we've talked about how easy it is for students to use their phones and the Brightspace Pulse app to take pictures of their work and hand it into Dropboxes, or to take pictures of their work, save them to their phone, and then hand those files into Dropboxes. What if students are using their Office 365 account to complete their work and saving their work in their OneDrive account? The Brightspace Pulse app makes it easy for students to hand in work that's stored in their OneDrive accounts. To hand in work that's stored in their OneDrive account, students need to navigate to the Dropbox or the Assignment folder, scroll down and find the Add File button, and click it, just like they did when they used their phone to take pictures of their work. One of the options in that list will be OneDrive Files. Students will need to sign into their OneDrive account before they can access their files. They can navigate to the different folders in their OneDrive account by scrolling over to the right-hand side and clicking on the arrow. Once they found the directory where their work is stored, they can double-click on the directory, find and select the file or files they want to upload to their Dropbox, click the Add button at the bottom of the screen, and their file or files will be ready to upload to the Dropbox or Assignment folder. Students can add a comment if they wish, then scroll down and click Submit. They'll get a confirmation page, and all they need to do now is click the Done button. After students have submitted a file, they're taken to the Dropbox or the Assignment folder section of the course. If they scroll to the right-hand side, they can see the number of files that have been handed in for each one of the Dropboxes. And that's how easy it is to use the Brightspace Pulse app.